Oh, hey, what's up? All right, so lemon curd chicken with roasted carrots. Come on in, let me show you what we're gonna do. It's not a lot of ingredients and it sounds amazing. Obviously, we're gonna be roasting carrots. So you need carrots, you need about a pound of carrots. Now this is the part that you can do either way. You can make your own lemon curd, but they sell this near the jams and jellies uh, aisle at Walmart, at all the supermarkets. So if you can just buy the jar, just buy the jar. But I did put it in the recipe down below. If you wanna make it from scratch, feel free to do so. Four chicken breasts, rosemary, sage, crushed peppercorn, and some crushed coriander seeds and a little bit of olive oil and, and my roasting pan, which is right behind me. Now I've cut my carrots at each end to clean them off. I don't, I don't like to peel my carrots. You guys might like it. I scrub them real well just to clean the outside, but I don't want to waste. There's a lot of carrots that get wasted in the peeling process. Okay, before you get too deep into preparing everything, get your oven preheated to 425 because you're going to need that. You might as well do that now at this part of the recipe. All right, we're going to carefully, these are round, you gotta be real careful. You wanna just hold it in place, stay away from your hand, and we're gonna cut them in half. So I, me personally, I start at one side, and I gently cover the, the spine of the knife so my finger's out of the way, and I press through to get a cut, okay? Then I rotate, and I do it halfway again. So the knife is nowhere near my fingers, and if I slip, I'm gonna go that way. Keep my hand above the knife on the spine, and that's it. Okay, first thing, you wanna make sure your roasting pan has a rack. Uh, remove the rack, lay out your carrots. Well, I'm just gonna throw, throw all your carrots in. Don't even, don't even lay them out nicely. Just, just kinda throw them in there. Then you're gonna get, this oil is gonna prevent the pan from sticking, and you want your carrots to have a little bit of oil on them. I'm gonna put some salt and pepper on these carrots. Now toss them around. Get them all coated with salt, pepper, and a little bit of oil. All right, get your rack in there. I'm not too worried if my rack hits the carrots or not. All right, let's put this to the side and work on our seasoning. And I always, I try to do fresh when I can, but sometimes I just don't make it to the store or I'm short on time because I got a heavy film schedule. But you guys, if you can always do fresh, always do fresh. Oh my goodness, this smells so good. These peel pretty easy. Just slide your fingers the opposite direction, pop the end off like that, see? That's all you do. I'll show you one more time, all right? Just take your hand like this, slide the opposite direction. It comes right off. And I always pop the end off because that's got the good stuff. Now, before we add the lemon curd into this mix, just take out enough to season your chicken. I would say about, I don't know, maybe a fourth of it to put on top of the chicken. There we go. Now we're gonna mix the lemon curd. Wow, look at that. About three tablespoons worth. Ew, doesn't look good. That green. Okay, so the one thing you wanna do is lift the skin up. You guys ever lift the skin up on a breast? This is bone in breast. I don't do boneless. I like the bone on. I don't know why, maybe it's superstition. Who knows? But you wanna gently work your way under the skin, just like you would a turkey if you're gonna put some seasoning under the skin for the turkey. Just keep following your fingers in there. And I'm gonna take my hands, or you can use a spoon if you want, but I'm just taking my hands, getting a glop of this, and I'm feeding it under here. I'm gonna push it under the skin and get it on there and just give it a rub. That's just gonna melt and seep in and drip out a little bit onto the carrots. It's gonna be awesome. So do all of them like that, all four of them. Okay, last step you're gonna do is bring your chicken breasts over to the roasting pan, lay them out. Remember that little bit we put off to the side? Just go ahead and sprinkle the herbs on top. Put this in the oven, 425 for 30 minutes. Then lower it to 350 and cook about 45 minutes to an hour. You wanna use a thermometer 
when these reach 165 degrees in the center meat, it's done. I've got a little dark. It looks beautiful. I'm gonna go in here, right here, and give it a look here. Right in the center. That's 174. That is done. Let's try this one over here. That's 169, 17. That is done. There it is. Lemon curd chicken with roasted carrots. Let's cut right into this. Here we go. Beautiful, beautiful. So moist. Look at that. Wow, that looks so good. Mmm. The herbs come right out. The sage, the rosemary. Let's try the carrots. I think carrots are amazing roasted. All right, wow. More lemon curd on the carrots, obviously. Wow, sweet as candy. Mmm. Really, really good. Those are some, <laughs> some greater roasted carrots. All right, you guys. Take care. Enjoy this recipe. Send me pictures. Don't forget to get my free app, okay? Everybody can have an Android, iPhone. Enjoy. Bye-bye.